Hi guys, welcome. This is Abhinav, and uh, today I'm showing you my laptop. So why I'm making this video, you will get to know in a short while. So basically, uh, this is the machine which is MSI Pulse GL66, and you can see the keyboard and everything there. And let's go for the RAM configuration for today. So as you can see, my system has 16 GB of memory, and this is something I have ordered from Amazon today. So this video will be like, you know, making the upgrades to the machine and what I have ordered, unboxing. So basically I have ordered a RAM here. So let me check if I can show you something. So I'm taking you live. Let's go to the Amazon. And let's go here. We'll go to the orders section. And this is the RAM which I have ordered today. So it's a 32 GB RAM, a DDR4 specification. This is the machine. This is the RAM, which is there on the screen. Let me make it a bit straight. I hope it's visible, right? Slightly more. Okay. So this is the laptop module I have ordered, which is a 32 GB uh, DDR4. So we are trying to, you know, give you an experience of unboxing and I'm happy that the, I've received this product uh, intact. So there's no problem. So I'm about to open the seal and uh, of course we'll try to install this into the laptop. So this is the video for unboxing. So here comes the packing, Amazon and uh, sealed very nicely done. This is the RAM which we are unboxing right now. So let us keep the laptop apart for a while and make the unboxing video for the RAM. And then we'll fix and then I'll showcase you the video again of what is the upgrade and how 32 GB is performing on the machine. As of now you can see I have a 16 GB module which is there with me. So two 8 GBs RAM are there, right? So this is the uh, overall setup which I'm trying to upgrade to 32 GB plus uh, the 8 GB so there are two more memory slots here and I'll be using one slot to upgrade the RAM one for 32 GB and one for the 8 GB cumulative memory could be somewhere around 40 so before let's begin this video and let's try to unbox the RAM and so this is the packing and let us unbox it up so just a second, let me take the laptop down. So this is a nice packing. I'm happy with the Amazon for giving such a nice packing. Very strong and uh, you know, tamper proof almost. So let's cut the package and see what's inside the packet, right? So we we'll make some cuts. And since it's a RAM, so it's a, it will be a small package. Let's make this opening a bit big. Okay, here we go. I guess should be enough. There it comes. Thirty-two GB. Uh, it's for notebook. One point two volt CL twenty-two, and. Uh, this is the you know the overall packaging it's uh, sealed intact see it's beautiful so we'll try to upgrade the same so this is the packaging that comes in and this is the laptop on which we are going to upgrade the ram so let us take it out of the package so from here Okay, nicely done. Okay, it is sealed. So let's open it up. Okay, so you have to break the seal basically. And here it comes. So you can see it's 32 GB DDR4. And this is the side which will go inside the laptop like this and this is the other part where the sticker is there right so we'll upgrade the laptop the same RAM 
in order to upgrade the ram we have to you know loosen these screws like this and uh, things like this to open this back panel and then we can upgrade so let us continue so one by one it is coming out see here it comes So this is the part where the speakers are, you can see these are the speakers on the bottom. So let's open this panel now and let's see what we can do. Uh, be very very careful with the placements of the nuts and bolts, could be an issue. So size is not the problem In luckily in this case, all are of identical size, so anything can be used. anywhere I am much happy with the laptop basically and uh, good to go I am really really happy with the machine I am just upgrading the RAM because I do some sort of video edits ok so now this is a different size very careful look at this you can see and so let's go with the corner nut must be of our same size be very very careful while opening these because Light error can be a trouble. Overall, there are 13. So, we are just opening this. Here it goes, one more coming. So let's open this as well. Give me some time, I'll open this now. Done, all done. Check once, everything is sorted. Yep. Now we'll have to open this panel. It's a very easy job, I mean, there's no harm. So, it's a very, very easy to use machine. See, from here, you have to open this. So careful while opening the panel, press here and use it. A small idea which I used, you know the packing that comes in, so you can just press and make some gap and can open like this. It's done. 
so let's go for the inside part so comes in take a look beautiful here this is really beautiful see there it goes so the cover is open and now you can see two fans you know the battery of course now this is the space where you can put additional nvme hard drive same like this one again additional hard drive one two three hard drives this this is the place where the ram is there so i need to upgrade to this part now jumping in quick to here so these are the heat sinks so there are two locks here you'll have to simply press the left right and the ram module comes out so this is samsung and you can see it's a 8gb one and uh, under this cover is the second one here it comes another samsung which is 8gb so we'll keep one samsung and one 32 gb here it goes so let's check the specifications first so good to go you can see it's a 3200 that's a pc4 3200 ddr4 3200 good to go good to go so let's try and see how it works for us so the 32 goes in and lightly very lightly simply bus just press and you are good to go so let's fix this as well and uh, okay so here it goes be very very careful you need to simply you know press once the slots are met then you have to press it up something like this and there it goes locked now well i can put the cover and well test run or maybe we can do the test run simply by putting the back panel about the 32 gb ram so let's go here it's heavy that's a heavy plate yeah to be honest so this will be just a press fit which we will do later but for now i'm just about to check the system if it is working as per my requirement let's power on the machine here's the 8gb and let's see what we get on the screen might take some time but good no problem okay cancel look at this we have a 40 gb ram just check this out here you go it's a 40 gb all right good to go experiment is successful and you can see the system is using just a second even the updates are there and everything is there my system is carrying a 40 gb ram now all we have to do is to simply close the panel it's all done
so it's as simple as that you can update your ram to 40 gb in minutes so this is the video which is going on i'm trying most of the time to keep the reels on so that you know the camera is rolling and you don't get the disturbing sound so that's the idea sometimes i have a pause in this video but more or less you know the video is on the camera is on and this is the module which came out from my machine which is an 8gb from samsung good to go so hope you like this video any queries or comments just ping me and i'll be happy to answer so as of now my cpu is i9 12th generation a uh, 12900h the ram is approximately 40 gb and rest 1 tb hard drive which i'll be upgrading very soon so we'll keep you posted with some new videos so hit the like subscribe button on the channel and of course don't forget to share with your friends if you like this video it might be of some help to some one who is looking forward to upgrade so it's a simple machine i mean just the idea right keep the tools handy to open the machine and go for an upgrade this machine deserves it so this is abhinav signing off thank you for watching the video